Muhammad Ali Professional Sports brings you boxing from the High Life Fronton in Miami, Florida. A tremendous, tremendously enthusiastic crowd here for what we think is going to be a corking 10-round lightweight bout before between uh, Alexis Aguayo, who has already had two titles in boxing, and the lightweight champion of Mexico, Jose Ramirez. I'm Don Dunphy, a ringside commentator, and with me is the former welterweight champion of the world, Carlos Palomino, who is going to do the color analysis on this fight. Carlos? It's, it, it promises to be a great fight. Alexis Aguayo is, in, in my book, one of the best fighters in the present. He's going against a kid who's got 67 wins and 54 knockouts. So it's going to be a great fight. Alexis has just left the junior lightweight division. is moving up to lightweights. So uh, we can expect a great fight. You know, uh, they've got 95 knockouts between them. I'll tell the folks just who's got what in a little while. We're almost ready to go up into the ring now. On the left-hand side is Jose Ramirez from Mexico. 135 pounds. There he is, Jose Luis Ramirez. And on the right-hand side, his opponent from Nicaragua, weighing 135 and a quarter. And here is Jimmy Ladies Lennon. Gentlemen, here we go. One of the featured events this evening, 10 rounds of boxing. Presenting to you first, sensational young fighter on my right from Guatapampo in Sonora, Mexico. He wears red trunks with his name in white print. He weighs in at a trim and even 135 pounds. The sensational record is 47 wins in 48 professional bouts, 41 of these by way of knockout. Introducing the lightweight champion of all of Mexico, Jose Luis Ramirez. A tremendous hand for Jose Luis. Ladies and gentlemen, his formidable opponent from Manawa, Nicaragua, weighing it in 135 and a quarter. Young man, with a, as a sensational champion, now retired as a junior lightweight, to Pam Payne as a full-fledged lightweight boxer, the one and only Alexis Arreo. Bill Connors, referee, will now give instructions, 10 rounds. Well, well, from the decibel count, you can tell Alexis Aguayo is the uh, favorite of this big crowd here, although there are many adherents for Ramirez. Aguayo is at 71 fights, winning 67 and losing only four, with 54 knockouts, while Ramirez has had 48 fights, and he's had 41 knockouts, his only loss, a knockout in the second round at the hand of Ruben Oliveras all of three years ago. So we've got plenty of power and good boxing ability in this bout. Both of them are wearing red trunks, and we can distinguish them by the uh, names on the trunks, Alexis and Jose Luis Ramirez. And Ramirez is a southpaw. He'll have the right hand extended. Alexis is orthodox. The scoring in the bout, a 10-point must. Ten points to the winner of a round, nine or less to the loser, scored by two judges and a referee. The mandatory eight count is in effect. A man floored must take a count of eight before proceeding. A man floored three knock times in a knocked down three times in a round is considered knocked out. And a man cannot be saved by the bell except in the last round. The referee is Bill Connors. He doesn't figure have to, to have much to do. These are not the type fighters who do much holding. Aguayo, Alexis, is pecking away with the left hand. This is a feeling out round. It is scheduled for 10 rounds. Alexis, who has already had two titles and given them up, wants to go after the lightweight crown. Not many punches landed so far, and they were just flicks. However, it is a 10-round bout. They're wary at this moment of throwing hard punches. Alexis has the reach on his opponent. He's 5 feet 10 against 5 feet 6 for Ramirez.
both doing it with jabs at the moment. Ramirez the right, Aguayo the left. And not landing too often. When they felt each other out, the flurry will start. A minute to go in the round. Round one of a 10 rounder at the Miami High Life Fronton. Brought to you by Muhammad Ali Professional Sports. There's a big crowd on hand and a very enthusiastic crowd, a knowledgeable boxing crowd. Half a minute to go in the round. Aguayo is trying to set Ramirez up, and Ramirez knows just what Aguayo is trying to do. Pretty good left hands by Ramirez. This round is almost over. There's the bell. 